Hey, what's going on, folks? It's Sunday morning. Now, normally, yeah, it's still morning, technically. Uh, normally, I do not drive on Sundays. Normally, I take Sundays off. But instead, this week, I took yesterday off. And so, I'm driving today on Sunday. And I want to make as much money as possible. Got a few money goals that I've got to reach here this week so uh there's a couple there's at least one big thing going on down in nashville today uh, i'm just now finished gassing up washing my car i'm ready to go i actually do have lift on right now uh normally won't get a a ping up here in springfield but sometimes you do so i've got it on the big deal today in Nashville is the Tennessee Titans game. And I generally try to avoid picking people up at big events like that just because it's such a hassle. Um, people are always in the wrong place and it's hard to find them and traffic is murder. And so I, I do tend to avoid those places, even though that's where you get a lot of the bonuses. I'm sure I'm probably losing some money at some point. But my strategy today looks like this. Lyft is offering um, hourly bonuses all the way up till 5 o'clock, and then it starts back again, I think, at 9 or 10, something like that. So I will be working Lyft exclusively until at least 5 o'clock. There is a Quest bonus for Uber, but I still need 17 rides to hit it, and I don't think I'm, I probably won't do that. So that's why I'm, I'm focusing on Lyft right now, and um, hopefully I'll hit some of those hourly bonuses. I plan on working out in the outskirts of town, trying to avoid the downtown area. Without a doubt, I'm gonna be, taken down into the zone that they have with some of the rides that I pick up even in the outskirts but that's okay uh, you know if I get a ping down there in the zone I'll try to pick them up if I if I can get out of the zone and back out into the outskirts that's what I'll probably end up doing uh, but that's kind of my strategy today is to work the outskirts around Nashville uh, the the outlying little small towns, Goodlettsville, Rivergate area, Madison, Gallatin, those areas, I'm, that's where I'm planning on working today and hopefully get at least two rides per hour during the guaranteed. So I'll keep you posted and updated and I'll let you know how it goes and, and I'll definitely at least be working till five. It's 1030 right now. So wish me luck. Here we go. Hey folks, just an update here on uh, my progress first hour actually I, today is the fallback day for the time and I had forgotten it so this first hour that I just got through with uh, was actually the 10 to 11 o'clock hour it's now 11.05 um, I got only got one ride outside of the zone uh, so I didn't get the there was a $35 guarantee that hour I missed so that sucks but the fare was $17, it was an airport trip, and then I didn't get anything else. Came back through uh, Opry land area, and now I'm heading back toward Rivergate, Goodlettsville area. So uh, it's now, and I've got a $30 guarantee this hour. Again, it's two rides outside the zone, uh, one ride in the zone, online 50 miles, and uh, 50 minutes out of the hour. So I'm hoping for two rides outside of the zone, um, and I'll holler back, let you know. Hello again. Uh, well, I'm over here on uh, Rivergate Parkway. I've got my app running, so if I get a ride, I, that's good. I'll shut this video down. But um, I'm not getting anything. And, you know, I mentioned, I think, in the first of this video that um, normally I work, I don't work Sundays, so... 
It might just be that this strategy of mine working the outskirts to get the guarantee for lift is not good for Sundays. I'm really trying to avoid the Titans game. I did drive through on my last uh, trip and saw just how bad traffic already was and so I really don't want to go back in there. So I think what I'm going to do is uh, abandon my exclusive lift strategy for the day. <coughs> and start running both apps and see how I do. Last hour I made $17. So let's uh, turn on Uber and Lyft and see how I do with that. I'll get back to you. Hey, back again. It is now 11.56. I am just coming out of the jungle area in Nashville, downtown. What I, what I like to call the jungle area. That's Broadway from uh, First Avenue on up to about Fifth Avenue. So I'm coming out of that right now. I've got both my apps off. Um, av right after I turned my Uber app on, um, I had both apps running using Maestro. I did get a ping from Uber, which brought me downtown. And uh, it was about I think I failed to mention what time it was in my last little clip, but it was about 11.30 when I got that. So uh, that ended up being a $15 fare with a $3 cash tip. So um, so that's good. I mean, you know, that worked out okay, decent. Um, so $17 first hour, $18 second hour with Uber and just just Uber actually during that hour. But what I'm planning on doing now is, and this is my normal routine when I drop somebody off down here because I do not like picking people up down here. So I'm heading out toward uh, West End. I'll head out toward uh, the Bell Mead area probably. And I'll turn stuff on after I get uh, up past or around, up around Vanderbilt University somewhere in there. I'll turn stuff back on and start again. Hey, 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 what's going on? Lunchtime. So, my last trip took me over to 2nd Avenue, just off Broadway. Uh, so, went offline again and I headed out this time toward, um, I'm heading toward Clarksville Pike on Rosa Parks Boulevard. Uh, stopped at the McDonald's. And here is a good McDonald's hack, okay? It's a McDonald's hack. Large drink, McDouble, $2.40. So I spent my $3 cash tip on lunch. And uh, I mean, you can't hardly beat that, man. That's, you know, for me, a, a McDouble and a large drink, that's a, that's a decent enough lunch for me. That's good. So anyway, uh, it's about 10 till one. Only made uh, 10 bucks on my last trip. Uh, and only got that one trip during the hour. But I'm taking a time off for lunch also. So $10 during lunch hour, not too bad. I'll check back with you again next hour. Hi, back for another hourly update. Uh, it's almost two o'clock, 1.54 at the moment. Uh, this past hour, I got two lift rides and made uh, 14 bucks. So, kind of seems like that's about the average I'm getting per hour. First hour, it seems like it was uh, 17 bucks. Second hour, 18 bucks. This hour, 14 bucks. So, around $15 an hour is what I've been making so far. Um, I do think I'm getting a little bit better pings uh, with both apps running today so may just be the Sunday thing you know like I say I normally don't drive on Sundays but this is all the people leaving the Titans game I'm trying to zoom in on them here oh shit I've got to go dude this is just crazy they're like cattle holy moly People leaving the Titans game. I got to get out of here. 
I can't even remember what I was going to say last. 321 right now. Um, last pickup. Picked somebody up over at Fisk University. And it's, uh, uh, taking them to Hooters over on 2nd and Church. And let me tell you, the Titans game is just now getting out. And we won by three points. So it was a really good game. And people are just flooded in the streets we got all kinds of uh, road closures downtown which is just the type of thing I like to avoid <laughs> so I turned everything off I actually had trouble and this is another problem I there's another reason that I I turn off downtown usually is because um, a lot of times I have trouble with the network I'm on Verizon I don't know if it's Verizon specific or not but a lot of times I have trouble with the network and connecting to stuff when I'm right downtown in a real busy, especially if it's a real busy time. So you can at least see me again. I'm getting on 24, or actually 65, I guess, right now. And I'm heading back toward my home. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna go back online or not at this point. Uh, if I do, I'm gonna wait until I get to around the Rivergate area, then I'll go online or approach, at least approaching the Rivergate area. I'll get off of the interstate and then maybe go back online. But I'll let you know one way or another. Hey, all right, back again. Um, so right now I am sitting in the back of the Hooters over at Rivergate Parkway. So I got out of town. Man, what a mess. But I really, I haven't gotten anywhere near my money goal for today, and I, I'm not going to hit what I wanted to. I wanted to make at least 150 today, but that ain't going to happen, I don't think. I'd really, I'd probably be satisfied with 100. I may end up taking less. Right now, I'm currently sitting on about 66 bucks for the day, um, which, well, I've got six hours in. That's not very good. Not good for Nashville normally. Um, and yes, I, like I realize avoiding the downtown m messy areas cost me because I drive away from it. I'm missing rides, I know but man i can't handle it some of you younger guys out there doing this you probably do it a lot better than i could but for me it's just uh too difficult so i like staying on the outskirts so right now i'm back online with both apps got lyft and uber running i got maestro running and i'm gonna sit here for just a little while and kind of see what happens and i'll holler back at you Hey, all right, well, it is 5.42 and I'm done for the night. Uh, I actually still have my apps on right now, but I don't expect to get any kind of ping up here. I'm already up in uh, Ridgetop, heading back toward home. So if I do get a ping up here, I will take it, but I'm about to just stop and shut the apps off and everything. I'm gonna stop at the dollar store up the road here. But I just wanted to kind of let every, let you know that it ended up being about a hundred dollar a day. I I made a lot more with Lyft than I did with Uber. I only hit like three Uber rides and got twenty seven dollars I think with Uber uh, and seventy four seventy five with uh, Lyft. So a lot better day with Lyft than Uber. But I didn't hit any of the guarantees for Lyft. Uh, and I just, you know, like, like I've been saying, I've been avoiding that downtown area, which I'm sure has cost me some rides, but hundred bucks on a Sunday, I guess. Uh, I don't know how average that is or not, but I've been out since about 9 a.m. Um, so working close to nine hours here today and a hundred bucks, so. Not that great, but could have been worse. 
all right guys i appreciate you watching thank you please like subscribe comment and i'll catch you later